Hi, I'm Mike. Welcome to the channel. In this video, I'm shooting H&N HP slugs in 0.218, 27 grain. So I was using the Mark III with uh, slug liner A. Uh, the macro wheel was uh, on 9. Micro wheel 3 and a quarter. And the valve adjuster was uh, in the center of the fourth line. So with those settings and uh, on that day I tuned the gun, it was 15 degrees Celsius. So with those settings and that temperature I got that regulator to, to, to work and uh, kind of well and to give me around about 975 average up to 980 and as low as I think it was 966. But unfortunately on the day I shot the gongs um, the temperature was I started up to 21 degrees Celsius so that made a big difference so I decided instead of um, tuning that gun to, uh, the speed lower I decided to see what they would do with uh, an average of, uh, of, of uh, I think it was 981 years now, unfortunately it was uh, very overcast and this GoPros um, only receives around about 75% of the light through that Eagle Vision setup. So if it's just a little bit overcast, then the footage is not good, unfortunately. So this was 178 meters. Uh, I already had, I think, three or four shots on gong before I started recording. So I, I aimed for 147.5 uh, regulator pressure. That was what I got on the day I uh, tuned this gun. It was 15 degrees Celsius ambient temperature. On the day we started off shooting the guns, it was 120. No, it was 21 degrees Celsius. So um, I could not get the regulator the pressure I wanted. But then it started dropping in temperature, it went down to 14, so the regulator could not really stabilize. So the, the group is not that good, but um, well, that's how it is. Um, I think if I had a stable temperature uh, and in the shade maybe with a sunshiny day, uh, I could have uh, gotten some st stable pressures from that regulator. So what one can do is on an app like Strelok uh, Pro you can record uh, average speed at a specific ambient temperature but uh, record as many speeds at different te uh, stable temperatures as possible and then of course Strelok will um, of course include that in its calculations as long as you just make sure to update the weather for that day. That's it, end of video. The next video will be the 27 grain 218 H&N hunting videos. I'm just not, not too sure when we're gonna get uh, proper weather here in the northern part of South Africa because uh, it's been raining for weeks and every day. So overcast and that Eagle Vision side shot uh, system doesn't work very well.